Alaska Picker, this is Christy, how can I help you? When your business is antiques. I received a Facebook message two days ago from a gentleman in New Hampshire. Hard to find items are good for business. Who had found something uh, in his mom's belongings. Then once in a while. He says, is this something you might be interested in? An item so rare shows up. What's in this box will make the buzz. It only makes a brief layover at the shop. And there she is. This happy little painting on black velvet glued to the bottom of a gold pan is an early original by pop culture icon Bob Ross. You can be 12 years old or 80 years old. Everybody knows Bob for, for whatever, either watching the original PBS series, people who knew him when he was up here. Not many people know, 40 years ago, Ross spent time in Alaska stationed in Fairbanks with the Air Force. And he goes, well, there's a great story that goes along with that. He says, my mother dated Bob Ross back in 1978 and 79, and it was a gift from him to her. Pre-famous Ross sold these early works for $25. He actually made more money selling these than he did um, his military salary. The true joy of painting is when you share it with other people. He went on to create thousands of paintings in his lifetime, so you'd think it'd be easy to find one for sale. No, not, not by any means. And if you're lucky enough to stumble across one, they aren't cheap. Yours for the price of 4,350 bucks. There you go. Once posted to Facebook, it took just three and a half hours for this Bob Ross to find a new home with a buyer in Japan. So if grandma used to have an Alaska themed gold pan hanging on her wall and it's now stored away in the attic. I mean, this was in a box until Monday, you know, in, in New Hampshire. You might want to check it for one happy little valuable detail.